Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Odyssey. Last time we were at New Donk City in the Metro Kingdom having a city festival with our pal Pauline. And then we wound up here in the Seaside Kingdom with this bozo up here drinking all the soda pop. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. We have to uncork three, four, I believe of these uh, little canisters here to show him who's boss. Oh, I thought I already did that. Well, apparently I, I it didn't register that I did that one. Um, but yes, we need to do that. There are four of these total canisters that we have to undo in order to free this gluttonous foe from drinking all of our Delicious carbonated beverages. How do you feel about carbonated beverages, viewers? Did it save any of my progress that I did? Jeez. Come on. It feels like I did, because I did get checkpoints, but maybe it didn't save like the most recent stuff. It says we need to be fleet of foot. Is this one of those things where I need a uh, speed flower? I think I said that last time. Or maybe we'll just be awesome at dodging things. This kind of makes me... Ooh, what is this music? Is Metal Gear Solid? <laughs> kind of makes me, uh, at least dodging these spiky rokes. Oh, and they want you to bring a Goomba up here. That's cruel. Um, we'll try that later. Maybe not today, but at some point. Um, this kind of makes me think of that Japanese game show. It was kind of the predecessor to... What is known here in the US and A as American Ninja Warrior in Japan, it was Sasuke. Um, it's probably the nerdiest I'll get when it comes to international television. Um, okay. Ooh. Is this just gonna let me have it? Oh, it was in front of it. I thought it was inside it. You gotta make sure that uh, you know it's inside you. That's for sure. Holy smokes. But anyway. This should be the third cannon. Cannon. Fire the cannon. Pow. And intelligently, the game does provide beacons to tell you where things are. It showed off when we were in New Donk, where each of the musicians was going to play, and I did not pay attention to that until I was basically done with the recording and it was unremarkable dimension. Oops, that probably. <laughs> Sorry, Mario. Let's give you a giant concussion on vacation. Don't do that. You ever seen those videos of people that try to... Bowser prints? With some big old paws. Does he have paws though? What do you call the appendages that like turtles have? I think that's what he is. Oh, let's listen to the uh, the sound effects for this this vocalization real quick. <laughs> Makes me think of uh Oh, excuse you. Spraying your your, your booty goo at me. Back off. It makes me think of um you know the Super Mario Superstar series that part of the Mario RPG where they they have Mario and Luigi just going <laughs> and that's just how they speak, I guess. Seems a little ethnicist. It's not what Italians sound like. All right. Time to uncork this final bad boy. I thought I was only going to have to do the two, but apparently it didn't register the second one that I did, but that's okay because we are slamming that button now. Boop, no whammies. Wink. Oh, no. How's that feel? You big old thief. Oh no, we gave him a headache and he's very, very mad. All right, let's take this guy out. So, this is kind of an interesting circumstance because now he will aggro on you. And you, oh, you're getting very close to me. <laughs> oh, he just straight up plowed into me, excuse you. Um, this is why we need these guys. This is, this is kind of, this feels like a Mario Galaxy boss of all of the ones that we've had to deal with so far. But you gotta cool him down and not run out of water. This is probably gonna be bad for me. 
Helps if I wouldn't use both buttons at the same time. Yes! Oops! Also, I do love that the water... Woo! I do love that the water takes a, uh... A, a muffled auditory cue. Or the... not the water. The music in the water. Now, I believe we need to get Mario up and over his head. Stop it. Stop it! Why are you running away? What are you afraid of? You got nothing to hide. Stop. All right. <laughs> this boss fight's going swimmingly, huh, viewers? Oh, yeah, and whenever you capture things, apparently it just really saps them of their life force. It would be nice to have a... Uh... Is that a heart over there? Yes. Definitely could use that. Coins are irrelevant. I wonder if this is one of those situations where I would be better off just waiting somewhere. Would I be better off alone? Alright, we got him. Cappy's very happy about us attacking this guy. Oh! Fellas! We're trying to work together here. What are you doing? Alright. I don't need the tutorial every time. Thank you, game. To spray in all directions. I'm actually curious what that's like. Ooh, yeah, alright. It's like Mario's uh, cat power. Where is he? Uh, well, there's, there's a heart. Nope, wrong bud. Maybe it is good that I have the tutorial up. All right, where did he go? Uh, sir? He might be around the outside. Actually, you know what? Oh, I hear him. He's coming. He can hear him coming. That's always a problem. You don't want to hear or smell that. All right, so apparently he's not... He's pretty chill down now. He's in a bit of a spin cycle. Whoa. Stop moving. Stop it. All right. <laughs> so this is going to be the uh, the crux of this episode, huh? Whoa. He's firing his lasers at us. What are those? Oh, they're shells. I thought it was pine cones for a second. I was like, what are you pine cones? Make sure you always fill up with water. If you run out of ammo, then you're not going to be able to swim very well. All right, get, get yourself stuck. Here you go. That's good. Oh, really? Really? And I killed my ride. <laughs> Viewers, everything is going perfectly. Don't you get it wrong. Oh, and he killed my other ride. Kind of makes me think of those, um... Like the big brushes that you see when you're getting, like, your car washed. Wash my car. All right. I need you to bump into some solid ground here. Oh my gosh, I overshoot it every time. Viewers, what am I doing? We're never going to get this soda back at this rate. I am handicapping the Seaside Kingdom. I don't think you get anything if you, if you soak them. Oh, but can you do it? Can you hit him this way? I didn't even know that. I thought you had to use Mario. I mean, we are technically using Mario, sort of. But... Does that count? I don't know if it counts. It does count, viewers. Oh my gosh, I didn't know that. It only took two hits? Oh, he's like Mega Mine. Okay. That's not what I thought I was supposed to do. I was trying to do the hard way. The long and hard way. That's a multi moon, though. We'll take it. Boom. Mario floating around in his flip flops. Cappy, very moist. Covered in goo. Soda for all. Glass is half full. You betcha. I'm always half full. Are you half full or half empty, viewers? I get teased sometimes for being the eternal optimist. But I feel like it's more fun to live life that way. All right, so the sparkle water fountains have been freed. But Bowser's apparently not here. Cappy wants to get a move on, but we're just going to have to have you slow your roll, Cappy. We're going to enjoy our vacation a little bit longer. How about? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do a hint. Where is it? Okay. Where is that? I don't know where that is. Uh, this music sounds like it's straight out of Animal Crossing. Am I playing New Horizons? How did we feel about New Horizons? Viewers, did you enjoy that? Did you have fun with that game? 
I feel like New Horizons was a game, at least for me personally, that scratched a niche. Big Animal Crossing fan, of course. It scratched a niche for a time in humanity that was a little dire and dark and brought us all together. But uh, unfortunately, as much as I enjoyed the game, because of the nature of when I play Animal Crossing games, like when I think of like the pinnacle of Animal Crossing, now I'm not talking in terms of like graphics or anything like that, but I feel like the best Animal Crossing game, just with the way that it was made, was uh, New Leaf, and that was the one that was for the 3DS. I don't know why I said it like that. But that's my opinion. I think New Horizons is functionally the best, but as a game in general, I don't think that it is. It doesn't feel the best to me. So that's kind of where I stand. How, can I get up on your head? How do I? Oh, woo. This might be a one where, might be a one where it circles the, how do I get that? Oh, you know what? I know. I know, get over here, you little goober. You're mine. Help me get the moon. What is it? What does the power moon do in a place like this? If it's fueling the power structure, where is this? Can I get you? Come here. Yeah. Bonjour, Dory. Is Dory French? I feel like the Loch Ness monster, which I'm assuming it's based off of, would be Scottish. So that feels a little bit offensive, maybe. And I'm pretty sure hello in Scottish is just English, which is hello. Correct me if I'm wrong, viewers. Okay. Can we play can we play volleyball now? Are we allowed? Huh. Just touch the ball to return it. I don't know how many we have to have to I don't care about this. Nope. Nope, absolutely not. I don't care what other people do. I'm my own man. Here we go. Okay. Boop. How many do we have to do to? What was the one in the um? A new dunk. That was. Uh. And you can use Cappy for this, by the way. I think it was like 30, 30 jump ropes. The only downside is you have to remember that there is a little bit of a delay when you toss Cappy, so you have to consider the the space of the area. I'm probably going to goof this up. I would love to do one try, though. Is it a cheap cheap? That's adorable. I mentioned this briefly when I was in the last episode talking about how um, I used to play the volleyball minigame in Mario Party 4. I don't know if it's in other Mario parties. I know it's definitely in that one. That game had really good minigames. Um, I play that all the time with my friends. Like, we would... Did I hit the ground? That looked like I hit the ground. <laughs> I think I cheated. I cheated! Oh, that's it. 15? Gets you the... I mean, I've been doing that. I mean, I don't know. That definitely also hit the ground. Yeah, these are hitting the ground. <laughs> that is uh, not how volleyball works. But I am the champ. Apparently, you only needed 15. Which is not really that much half as many jump ropes, but I guess the jump rope was a little bit quicker and more consistent. Looks like there's a little secret alcove over here. Anything of value? I hear a, I hear a moon. Do I see a moon? Is there one up here? Do I need another one of those goofy boys? Let me back up a little bit. Oh, there's just coins up there. Is that a ledge? Allegedly. <laughs> okay. Is there... Anything in here? Can I wall jump here? I feel like this is one of those situations where like I want to wall jump, but it's like not. I don't know if I can do this. Maybe I need to bring one of those. I need to bring one of those boys. Where are you? Where them boys at? You're the closest one. You'll be my victim. He's just having a good time, you know, just gooping around, and I'm over here just like nah. I need you to help me commit violence. Here we go. I did see a bonus up here though. And there's water, so. I don't know if this is the intended way to do this, but I do not care, viewers. I'm doing it my way, and it's my way or the seaside, I don't know. All right, so this looks like a 
a challenge, a bonus, perhaps. Okay. I, I, I still do really enjoy that they've um. Excuse me. That they've kept the uh, traditional Super Mario Bros. Just dungeon theme. Really enjoy that. All right. You know what? Back off. Okay. So. This looks like this is one of those challenges where you have to try to control one of these goobers and to not run out of water. I believe that that's kind of what they're going for, actually. I'm gonna line myself up a little better. Get the refill. You gotta get a refill on your on your goops on vacation. You don't wanna run out of your goops. Oh. Oh, there's a, oh. Is this the way I was supposed to go? I don't think so. Uh, can I get back up there or am I just gonna have to redo this? I do love this remix, that's very good. Everybody loves some beatboxing during a let's play, huh? I'm gonna do that one more time because I think that I'm good enough and I think you're good enough, viewers, to deserve. This is probably not smart. Oh no. You deserve the full experience on your vacation. I don't know where they expect you to have enough juice though to get through the, the secondary part of that. There's not really, is there another place to stop? I don't think so. Unless you just gun it. What happens if you go all the way up? No? Okay. Thank you. I'm gonna just try to conserve it as much as I can. Okay. Viewers have done it. We have done it for the bonus moon. Oh yeah, a treasure chest in the narrow valley. I love a nice treasure chest. Go ahead and crush Mario's ankles and legs. If you ground pound though, it apparently saves him from shattering both of his kneecaps. If I could get in this pipe, that'd be amazing. Okay. We've almost doubled our moon so far. Technically, not really, because the multi-moon is inflating things a bit. I totally understand. You're not really feeling like you're getting your money's worth. And you gotta get your money's worth on vacation. Is there anything worse that when you feel like you just got scammed, stop shooting your booty goo at me. All right, quit. All right, I don't know. I wanna go up. And is there a ledge here? Oh, they're like just hanging out. Okay, hold on. Oop, that's the wrong button. Game, how do I do this? Okay. So we did also see that there was a Goombat option going up that hill. All right. Um, I want to get there. How do I get there? I'm going to get as high as I can. So high, viewers. I'm so high for you. There we go. And then again, maybe, viewers, yes. It's on the cliff overlooking the beach. What a beautiful beach. Hanging out with your beaches. All right. Um... I'm gonna try to just go for the the Goombat. We'll try that. I don't know how many of these I need. Probably at least four or five, maybe. Ahoy, matey, don't mind me. I'm just gonna stomp in your face. All right, where are the rest of y'alls? Yar! And stuff. All right. I have these two. Can we get wet? I don't know. I mean, they were pirate Goombas, so they should be used to sailing the seven seas. Okay, apparently not, and that kills them. How the heck do they expect you to do that? I mean, there's three right here. Is three enough? Oh, it's four. Five? Maybe five's good. Come on! You landlubber? We're all on the same gosh dang team. Well, they don't know that. You don't know that I'm secretly a man. Ah! Stop it. Oh, you big dummy. 
You went and got yourself Goshtern killed. Also, there's the speed flower. I didn't even see that. This is going to be brutal. I bet I'm going to walk in there and I'm going to need one more Goshtern Goomba and I'm not going to have it. And then I'm also going to get killed by these things because I can't see. I do love this uh, Animal Crossing flow music. It definitely makes me feel like I'm on that little island of, of uh, New Leaf. I bet you I need one more, don't I? Hello? Hello? Hello, I'm here? Oh, did that work? She got just a peek of our beautiful physique and she's like, oh yeah. Wait, I've been catfished. You bet you have. You've been pirate fished. <laughs> wait, do I hear it? Wait, did I hear another moon? I did. Maybe that's just the sound of love. We use those Goombas as a uh, as defense. They can hold up for us. All right, I feel like I've gotten most of the moons around here. All the obvious ones, I think. I'm gonna keep checking for a moment though, just to make sure I didn't miss anything fun. This is one of those things where like you get kind of the majority of what you're looking for. And then, uh, once you do... No, it's not just, you know, it's not the bare minimum here, viewers. I'm doing more than that, of course. But, you know, there's only so much you can do over time. What are you? Are you one of those little bonus things? Yeah, I think you are. What am I supposed to do down here? I don't know what I'm doing. I am really heckin' lost. Ooh, it's sun. They're not, these are not the sun. These are moons. Oh my goodness. Sun chips. I'm hungry, viewers. I only had a light lunch. Does anybody remember when they first made sun chips? And this is like 15 years ago, a long time ago, maybe even longer than that. And people got so peeved about the fact that sun chips were in a loud bag. And they like boycotted them. A delicious, oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. A delicious, crunchy, flavorful treat boycotted because it was too noisy for this world. And then they remade the bag. Apparently the bag was so noisy, I think I, I recall. It was so noisy that it was like causing like legitimate disruptions in certain things. All right, please don't kill me while I'm doing this. While I'm waxing poetic about sun chips. Viewers, do you have a favorite flavor of Sun Chip? I'm a Harvest Cheddar boy. I love me a good Cheddar Chip. When I was a youth, um, I was very good at being content. And I, I say this like I don't do this now, but I was definitely more of a, I was, <laughs> I almost said victim, more of a culprit back in the DZ of, uh, I'm only eating like the same thing all the time. Creature of habit, whatever you want to call it. That was kind of my MO. And um, that was my, my go-to. Where the heck are you? Oh, you're on the pumpkin thing. Why? Oh wait, now you're on me. Are you on me? All right, so that's all that was. That was weird. Anyway, um, stop with the... Mm, I don't... The words juicy and booty do not deserve to be anywhere near each other. Stop. All right. Uh, where do you want me to go with this? I thought this was just a... Oh, wait, there's that fruit. Yeah, we need this. Got to go all, all the way and bring it around town for this one. But yeah, sun chips. You should... My entire, like, meal... When I was a kiddo in secondary school, I'll call it that, for those of you who aren't from the US today, was pizza, cold pizza, that's what the school served. Leftover pizza from whatever place would donate it because we were poor, hooray. And uh, sun chips, harvest cheddar sun chips every day. If sun chips want to sponsor me, uh, by all means, I would love to do a uh, promotional deal. I'll be your spokesperson. I'll be a sun chip off the old block. All right. So if we remember, there were some plants up here. We can get some pot. 
Whoop. Okay. Correct. I actually just recently, because I'm a nice boy, um, I've got some friends who are into gardening, and I had a friend share with me some plants. I used to really be big into having a green thumb. I haven't had as much time for it. Don't really have the space currently, unfortunately. Maybe someday. Would love to have my own little garden. But uh, since I don't currently, I was able to share some of my acquired plants with with Mama D Mike. She was very happy about that. Oh yeah, is this working? Oh yeah, it's like just a little just give a little squirt. Just give a little squirt. Oh yeah, oh yeah, squirt it, squirt it. Oh <laughs> Yeah. I, I don't blame you with all the things I was saying. Stop saying squirt it while you're watering the plants. It's weird. You're right. It is 100% weird. All right. Uh, look at these crabs. It's just sweet own petit crab. All right. That is a very deep cut. If anybody knows what that is from, you win 100 D Mike bonus points. That would be incredible. If anybody knows what that's from. All right. It's a show that I shouldn't have been watching as a child, but I did anyway because I'm a bad person. All right. Is this enough? I feel like that's probably good. It's already like blossomed and stuff. All right, you're safe. Oh, it's because of this guy. He doesn't want him to be there. Okay. Well, I watered it. Do you need a minute? Did I not water? Did I not water it enough? I thought I watered it enough. And did I do that rocket up there? I don't feel like I did. Viewers, there's just so much to do in the Lakeside Kingdom. Seaside Kingdom, not Lakeside Kingdom. I knew I was gonna, I knew I was gonna mess it up once. I messed it up in the very first intro that I did, so I had to redo it because I'm dumb. Did I do this? I don't know. Bon voyage. Let's go ahead and take a. Did I do this? This looks like I did this. Did I do this, viewers? Did I do this? Uh, I feel like I did this. I remember, yeah, I think I did this. It'd be cool if the game would tell you that. Also, I did not hit B to launch. I hit Y to launch because I'm my own man and I don't have to do what you say. I don't abide by your rules. I feel like I hear another. I don't know. Is that, did I, is this good yet? Oops, that's the wall. Is this good yet? Referring to that jump? No, <laughs> just smash face, face first into it. I'm gonna try to give it a little more water because I don't know if I did it all the way. And then I'm gonna wrap because we got other places to go. Bowser ain't even here. Bowser's chilling out somewhere else. Who's talking to? Does anybody remember? Uh, see, my life is just about. Oh, I, I, okay, I did get it. I was not expecting that to work like that. Canyon seed. Put your seed in the canyon. All right. Um, my life is just a series of references. Um, it makes me think. Let's check this out real quick, and if this is easy to do, I'll do it. Under a dangerous ceiling? All right, that's a horrible hint. I hate you and everything you stand for. Um, no, does anybody remember Chatot from Pokemon Diamond and Pearl when that came out eons ago? And then obviously they remade it. But uh. Yeah, you could, on, on the original DS, you could get it to say whatever you wanted. Even bad, inappropriate things. I don't think I did, because I was a good boy, but you know. Thank goodness, all is back to normal. All right, that's a pretty good amount of moons. I feel pretty content getting the easy ones, and there's not really much else left to do for now. We only needed to do 10 anyway, so. I think this will actually bring us up to an even number. 117, of course, is not. It's like, what, 140? Yes. That's spicy and hot. Mwah. Just for you viewers. We have more moons than we did. Stars. Mario Galaxy 1. That's obviously due to uh, energy inflation. The Snow Kingdom. Who I jab, Bowser? And that's what we will do next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Mario Odyssey, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.